Hey what's up guys you are watching full tech so finally oneplus 6 and 60 got the oxygen 11 beta 1 it's a huge update with the android 11 along with the new visual changes in oxygen 11 to know why oneplus it's said you get the new gaming mode new shelf new camera application dark mode always on ambient display so without wasting any time let's get into the full review of update Before updating, you must be on the Oxygen OS 10.3 firmware on the both the slots. So here I was on the custom ROM, so I downloaded the full ROM from the link given in a video description. But it has the RAR extension, so if you are updating through the TWRP, you need to delete the RAR extension using any file browser. Especially, I always prefer Mi Explorer. Now boot to the TWRP and flash the zip file. If you want the TWRP and root, install the TWRP installer and latest magics immediately after the flashing the rom and now factory set your phone and then reboot your device if you are already on the oxygen os 10.3 just download the update place it in a root folder and update it via manual update process when you boot to the oxygen os 11 under the settings about phone you will see the android security patch level is latest on the 1st july 2021 with the new easter egg of android 11 while using this ROM, you will immediately notice the visual difference in this new Oxygen OS 11 compared to the previous versions. Now we will see the system apps and the settings as one UI like loop. ROM has some slick animations, notification and setting pop-ups are centrally placed with the rounded corners which looks really awesome. The overall performance of this ROM is very good. So the another big thing in Oxygen OS 11 beta is the new game space. When you open the game space from the app drawer, you will see the all the games installed as a card on the screen and the three tabs on the top right corner. One is a game stats, like which games you played and how much time you played it. Another tab is for the moments in which you will see the all the screenshots and the screen recording from the all the games you previously taken by plus icon you can able to add any app or the game manually in a game space. If you swipe from the down, you will see the gaming modes which enable the CPU, GPU and the RAM optimizations along with the missed prevention to avoid the accidental notification drop down. There is also pro gaming mode, when we enable it, it will block all the notifications, boost the gaming performance, stop the secondary sim to improve the network connection. While playing the games, whenever we get any notifications from WhatsApp, Telegram or the Insta, we can swipe from the left right corner, there we can access the notifications in the floating mode and we can reply the messages. Quick setting panel will be only accessible when we swipe from the top, we will get the arrow like symbol, by tapping it only we can access the notifications. Instead of this, we also get the screen recording and rewind recording options. In this way, the new gaming mode is very useful for the gamers by improving their gaming performance and without interfering their games. So finally, always on display is available for the Oxygen OS where you are able to set the schedule for enabling the ambient display. Horizon light for the notification is now available in Oxygen OS 11. Under the customization settings, we will get the bunch of the new clocks for the ambient display. One of that is the inside ambient info display which is very useful for the accessing all the details from the lock screen without unlocking your phone. Now Oxygen OS 11 has the new dark mode under the display settings where you are able to set the schedule for the dark mode along with the per app dark mode setting. Shelf is the best part of Oxygen OS launcher as it helps us to access all the important contacts, weather, recent app, etc. Now in Oxygen OS 11, shape is updated to new version, it has the new sliding animation while opening and some extra stuff under its settings. The camera app is also got updated in new version of Oxygen OS, under the camera settings you are able to add the other camera modes in a swipe up setting. This app also has a smart context detection tab which allows us to detect the phone number, email addresses, business cards and the QR codes. Another useful feature like the tripod long exposure while shooting videos on the tripod is extremely useful. Except all these settings camera is now taking the good and clear pictures and videos. The messaging app is also got updated and it has the AI powered OnePlus messages where you have to just log in and later it will categorize all the incoming messages in the bill reminders, offers, coupons etc easily. 
Under the display setting, you get the vibrant color setting option. It helps us to improve the video color and the contrast to make it more vivid. Last but not the least, now we get the new charging animation which looks so cool. Instead of all these goodies, ROM is smooth and working great but sometimes you may feel some animation glitters, otherwise everything is ok. So as per my opinion, you can upgrade to Oxygen OS 11. So that's it for today guys. If you think I help you, please like and share this video, subscribe our channel, press the bell icon for the notification of our upcoming content. Thanks for watching, signing off, bye bye.